Her ego is hurt. Now she's going to respect you more. Now she's going to understand there's consequences to what you do, how you act. If you don't listen to me, I will not give you my time. <laughs> Drew yourself up. This video topic will be about disrespect cannot go unpunished. Let's get into it. What happens when a girl disrespects you? She insults you, your frame, who you are as a man. How can she learn not to do that? Simple. There needs to be consequences to her decisions and her attitude and being. Women know this shit. They won't show attitude to the celebrity, to the rich people, to the strong people, to the attractive guy with lots of options. Why? Because they know they can be replaced. Her nature is competition towards other females. She knows she can be replaced, then she'll act her best. If she thinks that she has a grip on you and that you cannot leave her, she will stop trying. She'll make fun of you, she'll disrespect you, she'll lie to you, she'll play tricks on you, manipulation. Girls will go do this thing where they go to clubs with their friends and cheat on guys, and they won't, they won't give a care in the world because they'll know there's a guy waiting back at home for her. After she fucks a bunch of guys that don't give a shit about her. That's why when girls go to clubs and parties, they're not serious relationship material. They're not. Nor should they be, because they'd suck at it. They have lousy control over themselves. If she disrespects you, what's gonna happen to her? I once went to a cinema with a chick. And at the cinema, the girl wouldn't listen. She kept going on her, on her phone, on her phone. I told her enough. You know what I did? I got up in the middle of the cinema with a bunch of other people. I got up, I walked by, and I walked and sat up beside some random fucking group. I did that and I stayed there sitting. I just told the group, you know, what's up? I just kept watching the film. Ignored the chick. Ignore the people sitting beside me and just I just watched the fucking film. 10, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. I was pissed off, I was had it. And then was this the end of the film? I can't remember exactly. I remember after Chick kept asking me to come back, come back, come back, come back, text me and all that shit. And she told me fine, I won't go back with my phone. Get back up, sit down beside him again. What happened? He went back on their phone. What happened? As we walked out of the cinema, I looked at the person, looked him in the eye, and told him, Thanks for the film. Bye. I was walking away, and the chick freaked out. Because they're not used to guys who have self confidence, self respect. They're not used to guys walking away from their pretty little asses. They're not used to that. So when it happens, they're shocked. They're startled. Whoa, what the hell is happening? This guy's willing to walk away from me? Her ego is hurt. Now she's gonna respect you more. Now she's gonna understand there's consequences to what you do, how you act. If you don't listen to me, I will not give you my time. I could give, I could be giving my time to someone else who actually deserves it and would listen to my program and understand. I'm a male. You are a female. I ask something. If you don't do it, I'm not obligated to stick around. And you're not. Not obligated. These females are used to mistreating and doing things that insult guys. The thing is, guys themselves allow this shit to happen because you don't correct these chicks. You don't punish these chicks. You don't put her on ice. You don't tease her and not give her any dick for a week, two weeks, a month. No, you don't do that shit. Because you're so... Ugh, I want to I wanna fuck so much. I want to be inside those little this delicious fucking wet guts. No, she doesn't listen, she shows attitude, mistreats, too much drama, you don't deal with that shit, you punish it. No dick for you, no attention for you. I'm gonna go give my attention to someone else, then we're done. Your leverage is your fucking time. When she does not respect that, you do not respect her, and you take yourself and you go somewhere else and you punish them. She, you didn't like something she did? She's not dressing well. She doesn't care. She insults you. 
always on her phone, never listening to you, complaining all the time. Take your time somewhere else. Stop seeing them. See them less. Tell them. No, I didn't like that. So, for now, I don't want to see you. Text them that or call them that. They'll learn a lesson. And if they don't, then that person does not give a fuck about you. Because someone who gives a, f a female who likes you will do everything she can to be with you and will learn from her mistakes. If she doesn't, ah, that sucks. Move on. Move on. Well, you think what? They, what? They're gonna respect you if you accept and tolerate all their bullshit? In what fucking world? The most respected people are people that are feared and respected. They fear them for what they can do. They fear the fact that they might leave. They respect who they are and what they stand for and their energy and their personality. But they also fear something. If, when it comes to females, if you do not fear something about you, then they will not give a shit about you. If you do not, they do not fear losing you, they won't value you. That's how it works. If she disrespects you through text, or she makes you wait too long through text, then you make her wait longer. Boom, consequence. You're not reactive, you're proactive. You're not complaining and double texting her, triple texting her, asking where are you, where are you, what are you doing, why are you answering my text? No. Relax. She takes an hour to answer your text. You take an hour and a half, two hours. She takes an hour to answer your call. You take two hours, three hours. You don't answer her calls at all. Try to set up a date. Maybe we'll see, I don't know, the unsurety. You tell her, you know what? Forget it. Text me when you're done playing games. She's playing games with you? Consequence. Take away, rip away your attention. Start hanging out with other people. Start hanging out with other girls. There's a consequence to what you do. Guys, guys, you need to stop accepting women's bullshit. You need to stop allowing them to walk all over you. Because if you do, you'll never respect yourself. They'll never respect you. And the first thing for a woman to love you she's, is first she needs to respect you. She needs to respect you before she can love you. Wait, do you want to be one of those guys where she loves you but doesn't respect you? She'll be cheating on your ass the entire fucking time. I love you, I love you, I love you. You're like a brother to me, all that crap, whatever the fuck. Yeah, go ahead. If you're beta, go ahead. If you're too soft and you don't have an in you to punish your girl for her disrespect and her attitude. Okay, but learn that women aren't going to value you as much. Learn that women value what they fear losing. Women value... Respect, authority, strength. You want to stand up to her? Her going all dramatic and you're just looking all calm and serious like... No. No. I'm out. Bye. Women are reactive. The feminine nature is to be... Picky and dramatic and over the top. And to poke at everything and see what happens and act childish and rebellious. The masculine energy is the authority, the pillar, the hard rock that's in the river. The feminine is the river that goes around the rock. The feminine is the river that go goes around the rock. The masculine is the rock in the river that doesn't move no matter how much water is pushed against it. How can she respect you and love you if you won't respect yourself when it goes up against her? It's like, what? How can you respect a king if the king isn't willing to fight it back against his against his village? How can you respect the authority if the authority isn't willing to arrest you for not listening to them? People respect things that have power, things that have value, things that are willing to walk away, or things that are willing to put a consequence and punish you for what you did. You don't listen to the system. Consequence. You don't listen to my time, you don't listen to what I want, you don't you don't respect my time, you don't respect my needs. Consequence. Move move on. Find someone else. Watch the chicks get jealous, get interested in you again, and start seeing the old you. Because most guys, what happens for, for guys who understand game and all this stuff, guys who are on the road to becoming alpha, 
if you get and you're meeting a chick and you've seen her a lot, what happens is you're the super cool, confident guy who's going to walk away in the beginning. But as you get closer and closer, what happens? You get too comfortable. She gets too comfortable. And if she starts making fun of you and you're getting too attached, never get attached to anyone. No person, no family member, no city, no job, no company. Never ever get attached. Because the moment you get attached, people and things seem to think that they can dictate you and disrespect you. No, you're worth more than that. You are worth more than that. You have a lot of shit that's important to do. So your days should be filled with a bunch of important things, not things that waste your time. Remember, everything a person does when it comes to women, there's a, a reason behind it. If she, there's a reason behind it and there's a consequence behind it. Females need to know that when they're dealing with you. Because if they don't, they will disrespect you, make fun of you, and before you know it, you're just one of her guy friends that she makes fun of, a male orbiter. Every freaking disrespect has a consequence. Write that down. And don't forget to like my shit, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.